hi hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel so in this video we're going to introduce the concept of differentiation and we're beginning with uh, differentiation by first principle which is a type of differentiation or a method of the taking the derivative of a function by definition okay so you can see here by definition of a form of derivative of a function at a point say x1 Okay, so uh, we note that uh, the derivative of a function, of course, we know our y is equal to a function of x. So the derivative of a function is always with respect to the independent variable x. So we write derivative this way, dy dx, that's derivative of y with respect to x. Or you can write it as y prime, or you can also write it as f prime of x. Okay, so, and we say by definition, this derivative is given as, uh, is given as the limit uh, of uh, f of x plus change in x minus f of x all over change in x as that change in x goes to zero. Okay, remember this change in x here, this h here stands for change in x, which is what we have here. Okay, so you can use a, we are using h to also represent that. All right, so now you can look up this from this particular, we can actually get the proof of this, of how we derived this formula from this particular graph we have here. Uh, that we are going to see in another video. Okay, so, but this is the formula for determining the, derivative of a function with respect to the uh, independent variable okay so and uh, we call this definition the differentiation by first principle or you can also say differentiation by definition okay and so we're going to see some examples on how to do this all right so we want to find the derivative of these functions uh, with respect to x, this stands for with respect to x, and we are going to do that using the first principle approach. Okay, so beginning with example one, here we are given that f of x, now you recall the formula. The formula says that uh, f prime of x, which is a derivative you are looking for. Okay, so now you can see that the basic things we need here there are just two of them. We need the f of x plus change in x and then f of x itself. Now, but f of x has been given. So all we need to do now is to find the f of x plus h. And now by uh, principle of evaluation of function, we can see here that our x is simply replaced by x plus h. So we'll come into this function and do the same. So that's going to give us 5 into x plus h so we are replacing x with x plus h and that's going to give us 5x plus 5h minus 6 okay so now we have the value for f of x plus h and that of uh, f of x so we substitute now and so that means that our f prime of x is simply equal to the limit as x f, h goes to 0 of f of x plus h we have here as 5x plus 5h minus 6 then minus our f of x is equal to this which is a 5x minus 6 we have all over our h okay so if you open up this bracket you will have limit as h goes to 0 of 5x plus 5h minus 6. Then if you open this bracket, you have minus 5x plus 6 all over h. Okay, so and from here, you can clearly see that things can cancel each other. 5x will take away minus 5x. Minus 6 here will take away 6. So we have left and our h here will cancel h. So if we now take the limit as h goes to zero, 
you will see that our answer is just five okay and so that's the solution to the first uh, example we have here okay the second example says now here since we now know that we will need the f of x plus h so let's quickly get that also so this implies that f of x plus h will be equal to so we are replacing x with x plus h all squared then plus one and so we'll try to expand and if you do that you will have x squared plus 2xh plus h squared kindly take time to do that expansion and that will be plus one there is one here so now we can now write our formula which says that dy dx is equal to and so from here now we can see that our f of x plus h so we're just going to make substitution now f of x plus h is x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus 1 then minus our f of x is x squared plus 1 and that's over h as h goes to 0 now open the bracket so here we have x squared plus 2xh plus h squared plus 1 you open this bracket you have minus x squared minus 1 and that is over h okay so at this point clearly we can cancel out x squared will go and 1 will cancel minus 1 so we just have now here we have 2x h plus h squared so we can factorize out h here and if we do that we'll have the limit as h goes to 0 if we bring out h we are going to have 2x and then plus h all over the h down so the reason why i'm bringing out that h is so that i can use it to cancel the one below and when that happens we are going to have the limit as h goes to zero of 2x plus h and if you put your h now directly as zero this becomes zero and so Okay, and so your solution is equal to 2x. And that's your solution, okay? So, and that's uh, how to take uh, differentiation by first principle. Find the value of f of x plus h, then substitute into your formula, which is this. And when you do that, just uh, find a way to cancel out the h in the denominator before directly substituting your h as 0 into whatever you have left and then you will get the value for your differentiation remember that this is our a f prime of x all right so and that's where we'll end it for this video kindly subscribe to our youtube channel and we'll see you in our next video bye